The Red Hawks continued their road trip by heading to Cookville, Tennessee to take on Tennessee Tech. Southeast shot from the outside early and often, attempting six three-pointers before ever trying a shot from inside the arc. The Red Hawks hit two of them and went off to an early 6-3 lead. Southeast made six threes in the first half, led by Denzel Mahoney who hit two of them on his way to 18 first half points. The game got tight towards the end of the first half as a dunk by TTU's Courtney Alexander made it a four point game. Ferris Phillips hit a three with 31 seconds left to bring it within one, but Mahoney responded right back with a three of his own at the end of the half. As Southeast went into halftime with the lead, 33-29. The Red Hawks gave up the lead early on in the second half, giving up a nine point run to the Golden Eagles. A basket by senior Daniel Simmons showed life for the Red Hawks. Simmons also knocked down a three to score eight points in the second half to finish with 13 in the game. Mahoney was once again the leading scorer for the Red Hawks as he poured in 11 second half points, finishing the game with 19. He also made an impact on the defensive side with a steal that led to a Ladarius Brewer basket. The Red Hawks couldn't get anything going in the second half, however, and fell to the Golden Eagles 76-65. Kajon Mack led the way for TTU with 22 points, while Phillips came off of the bench with a double-double with 19 points and 10 rebounds.